and welcome back to Ashley U Life. In today's class, we're going to check out some hair products by the brand Mori. So Mori did contact me after seeing some of my other review videos and asked if I would like to review their products. And of course, I'm always interested in trying new things, especially when it comes to hair, because I just, you know, hair is everything. And keeping it healthy and strong is definitely something that I strive for. And so when they contacted me, I looked up their website, I looked up the ingredients that they were using, and it seemed pretty legit. And so then I also did explain to him though that I am very honest, and I don't just like to get free products just to get free products. I really try to review them so that I can give you like an honest opinion. So I told them that I'm very honest and if I don't like it, I'm gonna let them know. And so I said, if you guys are okay with that, please send it on over. So they did and here we are. So I've been using the products for a couple weeks now and we're gonna talk about that. But right now we're gonna jump back real quick to when I received all the fun Mori hair products in the mail. So what do we have here but my package that just arrived from Mori. So let's open it up together. Well, it does seem to have been a little uh, <laughs> rough rides for this guy right here and for this guy too right here. But, I mean, it's just the packaging on the outside. All that matters is what's on the inside, right? Okay, so let's see what we got. Mineral shampoo. Mineral ultimate growth spray. Mineral shampoo. Is this the same thing? Looks like I got two shampoos. Okay, that's cool. Mineral conditioner. And then what's this? Repairing hair mask. Ooh, super exciting. So I'm going to try all these items for a couple of weeks and then I will let you know what I think. I'm going to start today and uh, wash my hair. I would like to mention that the texture on these boxes is amazing. It's like so soft. I used to have a James and the Giant Peach book when I was little that I loved. The pages, the book, I don't know what it was about it. It just felt so nice and I get the same feeling when I am holding these boxes too. So just thought I'd say that. The, um, the boxing is very, very nice. I like the packaging it came in that got a little bit damaged. The products inside are completely fine. One thing I am noticing is that I took the repair hair mask out of the box uh, just to kind of see how to use it, when to use it, to use it before or after you shampoo and condition. And also the same goes for the growth spray. It doesn't really say when to use it. So I guess that's something I'm going to have to look up on their website, but I do wish there was maybe a little bit of instruction that came with this just to help me get this in my hair faster. I wanna, I wanna start healing my hair now. That's one thing I, I, I did notice. It does say taking your hair on a vacation, it will start with the minerals, 77 trace minerals, 18 aminos, and I, I believe this says it has 77. So I'm thinking it's trying to tell me to use the shampoo and conditioner first, and then proceed with caffeine, which will stimulate hair growth. Is this the caffeine? I mean, it's a little confusing, because it's like, uh, do I, this says, this talks about growth spray, and you're, uh, but. It's a little unclear on how long I leave it in my hair, do I wash it out, what do I do, you know? It's, a, it's just a little unclear. And so like I thought, looking on their website, I was able to find detailed instructions on when and how to use the products. I just kind of wish it would have came with something in the mail so they didn't have to take that extra step and go online. But hey, they were there, I figured it out. Shampoo and conditioner first, use the hair mask for five minutes, and then after you're out of the shower, you spray the roots with a growth spray. It's simple enough, but I still do wish it came with the instructions in the box. So I just finished working out, hence my hair being all kinds of crazy, but I just kind of wanted to show you my hair before I start trying the Moray shampoo and conditioner and all their hair products um, and just kind of see what kind of state it's in now this is day three hair so I'm just gonna brush it a bit okay so this is my hair before I start using the products so I'm gonna just, from now on, use that shampoo and conditioner and their hair treatments, and then we'll see what my hair looks like after some time of using the Moray products. Okay, so I just finished working out again, but since the last time I saw you, I've used the shampoo, conditioner, the hair mask, and the growth spray three times now. Today I'm gonna wash it again, but I kinda just wanted to show you how the hair is after three times use and kinda the same conditions that I just showed you. Okay, so what do you think? I feel like I see a lot less frizz. And again, considering it's day three hair and I just combed through it and I had teased my hair, put hairspray in it and done all this stuff to it, like I feel like 
it's looking better like look right here don't you think and I do feel like when I'm doing my hair daily, I do feel like my hair feels more manageable. And again, I have noticed a little bit less of a frizziness happening days where I don't wash my hair. But I am gonna go wash my hair for the fourth time and I'm gonna get ready for the day and then I'm gonna come back and I'm just gonna talk to you a little bit how I'm feeling about the product in general. And so now this is my hair freshly washed. You just saw my hair three days old, brushing it out after working out, hairspray, all that jazz you could kind of see. And now that I'm looking at the comparison between before I started using the products and after I can definitely see a huge difference I think it is so important to take pictures if you're curious to know if something works because just going off my feelings I feel like yeah I, I feel like my hair feels good I feel like my hair looks good I feel like it seems to be less frizzy but it's like it seems to be less frizzy now to look at a picture and see like especially looking at the back of my head right here oh my gosh I feel like there's a huge difference now granted my hair is not you know presentable and it's not done done but that's that's just me combing it out and you could see on the left hand side it's just way more frizzy than on the right hand side and it's the exact same scenario of three day old hair just finished working out and brushed it out and there's nothing else that I did different except for I changed my shampoo and conditioner and started using the hair mask and the growth spray and so let me tell you that I have been very happy with this product I feel like it's working and I feel like it's awesome there was another hair product that I tried out maybe a couple years ago and I liked it and I think it did really good things but the smell was just so weird and my husband hated it in fact he, when I started using it he came home and he hugged me and he was like whoa what's in your hair and I was like you could still smell it it was just shampoo and conditioner and he's like I hate it stop using it and I was like well I'm kind of reviewing it so I'm gonna have to use it for the next couple of weeks so you're just gonna have to deal with it but let me tell you he did put up a fight and he has not said one word about my hair in any way of how it smells so Maury you got that going for you right now the smell is great and that being said let's talk about the smell so the shampoo I didn't smell it ahead of time so I was in the shower and I put it in my hand and I just like waft it and it was like oh it reminds me of summer days it reminds me kind of of a creamsicle but also with like hints of citrus oh it's just so pleasant I really, really do enjoy it. And the conditioner, it smells exactly the same, except way less potent. Like the shampoo definitely has like a smell factor that's like off the radar. And as far as the hair mask goes, the hair mask smells like nothing. It has the texture of like a really heavy cream, like a Cetaphil cream lotion, if you've ever used that before. It has that kind of texture and it looks a little bit grayy, like kind of like cement. But yeah, again, it kind of smells like this shampoo. It's just a very light scent, it barely smells like anything. And then the growth spray is very herbally. I actually thought if my husband wasn't gonna like anything, it was gonna be this, but again, he hasn't noticed. So I think we're in the clear. It's very essential oil forward and it's really nice. And it has a little bit of a peppermintness to it. And it kind of makes the scalp a little tingly after you use it, which, hey, I guess that means it's working, but I enjoyed it and I liked it. I'm gonna continue to use it for sure. The only other thing besides quality that I take into account is how much does something cost and so I went on to mori.com and I was able to look up their prices which I'll show you now the package that I got as they sent it to me they said it was going to be worth $175 and if you do look online you can see that it is $175 normally and if you break up that into the five products they gave me because they did give me two shampoos that's $35 each which is not unheard of hair products can get really expensive so I don't think that's so out there but it is on sale right now the same package that they sent me for $119, which makes it $23.80 a item, which I think is a great deal, a great, great discount. And then even better though, they had a package that came with two of each, which I think is absolutely doable. So if you are able to buy in bulk like that for $149, I feel like that's a great steal. And of course they gave me a little coupon code that I'll leave down below, LIFE20. So you put that in at checkout and you'll get 20% off that as well. So I think that even makes it more of a deal. So definitely if you're looking for a new shampoo and conditioner, I would definitely check this out. I love it so much and it's the smell and the way it makes my hair feel and getting into how it makes my hair feel when I use the shampoo my hair doesn't feel like soft necessarily after it feels a little bit like textury like I feel like I can feel my hair like it feels a little rough but I think that's what shampoo is supposed to do it's supposed to like clean and get in there right and then when you put the conditioner in oh it's silky smooth it feels so good and then the mask just enhances that feeling of silky smoothness and you just leave it in for about five minutes I mean it extended my shower routine just a little bit because I don't normally use a mask but hey it's totally worth it I just uh, put a little YouTube video up in my shower and just uh, watch away the time <laughs> 
And then when I get out of the shower, after I brush my hair, I kind of just piece through it and do the little spray. Now I will say with the spray, let me do say this one thing. The spray, awesome, smells good. I feel like maybe it's working. I did notice this morning when I had my hair, I mean, I've kind of like made my hair, you know, it's in its situation. But this morning I did notice like a lot of little wispies. So I'm not sure if that has to do with this growth spray already. Um, I do try to put collagen in my coffee sometimes. So I know that's supposed to promote hair growth as well. But it was interesting that I did notice like little baby hairs that I hadn't seen before using this. Coincidence? I don't know. But the one little thing I did want to say about this spray is that it is, the pump is a little stiff and maybe as I use it more, it'll get looser. But the way the bottle is shaped in my hand, like, I don't know why, I just feel like the bottle always wants to slip out of my hand when I'm trying to spray it in my roots because I'm trying so hard to push down on the pump, but then the bottle is just a little thick and so it's just a little awkward to hold, I'll say. And so it just feels like I'm always struggling just a little bit. But that's like such a small negative. It's not even really a negative. It's just more of a technical thing. <laughs> but I thought I'd share anyways. Oh, I just got a whiff of it. Maybe I should just spray it. It does smell so good. You just feel like, I don't know, if you close your eyes for a second, you might be like laying and relaxing in a spa. It's just so nice. So I did real quick want to go over product itself. Um, it has really clean ingredients, super simple. It has 77 minerals, five vitamins, 18 amino acids, and it's also paraben free, fragrance free, cruelty free, silicone free, sulfate free, which is amazing, and GMO free. Something with those kind of ingredients and actually works is amazing. So I would highly recommend this product. And if you're looking to change it up, give it a try. What can it hurt? I'm going to continue to use this. And if you get the extra 20% and they have sales going on, I feel like it's a win-win so please do let me know if you plan on ordering it and if you do when you finally try it out if you like it I would love to hear your experience as well I'm sure other people in the comments would love to know too so before you run to mori.com make sure to like and share so other people can like and share and don't forget to subscribe I'll see you next class I mean my hair looks good right if you watch normally you know what my hair looks like. I feel like it just looks very contained and put together, you know? It's like I hardly had to do anything to it. I just put a flat iron towards the ends of my hair. That was pretty much it. And besides teasing it, that's really all I did to my hair. And I feel like it looks like super nice. It's moving, it looks soft. I feel like it looks healthy. And hey, I'm Ashley. I do hair, makeup, life hack classes, and reviews. So make sure to hit that subscribe button and the little bell next to it so you don't miss out on any of the fun. I'll see you soon.